Hello, and welcome back to our YouTube channel. Topic uh, that we have today is uh, in general. Uh, it's usually we will discuss about uh, common mistakes that are made by FRM candidates. So, if you are around the corner for the exams, then I mean I wish you good luck. But if you are starting your preparation, please avoid these mistakes, who which is like which are commonly made by the ex candidates so let's move ahead and before we go ahead uh, being frm student please understand what is the cost of a single wrong question in the exam so if i look at in 2024 currently along with your registration exam fees it comes around $1000 there are 100 questions in total so if you just just your one wrong tick and your 10 dollars are lost it's valuable amount so just ensure that you have very well planned preparation and if you plan or wish to has this fear or uncertainty see it's a big amount for me it's quite material Okay, so if you wish to hedge this, we can certainly help you out. So, how? I mean, you can always get in touch with our team. They'll they'll be happy to assist you. And why it is important to hedge this risk? That's also very important to understand. See, in whichever country of the world you are based out of, it's very important that you. starting salary is a reasonable number so if i talk about indian rupee context if you just if you have just uh, graduated from normal mba college it could be uh, like in this range but if you have got some certification along with your mba it can go up to this range and over period of time this 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 difference widens so it's very important i mean uh your your strategy or how serious you are at this point in time for your frm exam that will decide this career trajectory see of course future is uncertain no one has seen it but it's very important that when we are preparing we have right strategy right hard work right mentorship these are the key things that you need to take care of and uh, let's see common mistakes that are made by frm candidates here we have got uh, one frm candidate uh, you can call any name say kelvin just a uh, random name so these are the mistakes that are made we will see this in detail one by one so only self study wasting time in in validating books wrong question banks most important one i would say third one no progress tracker no structured way for preparation and if you are not dedicated then god bless you no one can help you out so only self study it only works for the people who are like from iit and iims or even for that matter from harvard uh, so it works from only them if you are i have a student then this is most important mentorship is most important always in general always it's best to be part of any communities so see if you work in your own silo like you will be uh you will be disconnected from the world on the progress they are making so it's always good to be part of some community which keeps you upgrading or updating in terms of the latest practices that are followed in the industry and uh, from mentor also it's a six month commitment uh, which can of course change your entire career trajectory so see people tend to pay multiple times exam fee but they uh, they are not willing to go for any mentorship so that's where like you, how how wise you are that's where the difference will make if you are just thinking in point in time or if you are 
if you are concerned about your entire trajectory, that's something which is very crucial. So that's mistake number one, self-study, studying in silos, no mentorship at all. That's the mistake number one. And mistake number two, uh, I would say most important again, uh, it's wasting time in validating books. See, in books, there is an ocean. I mean, uh, you cannot validate each and every piece that is there in the book. What you should be mainly focused on, you learn things rightly and you make your preparation aligned with the exam because trust me, time is most precious. Once you lose your time, that will not come back ever. If you lose money, that may come back to you. But if you lose time, then God bless you. I mean, then it's your luck which can help you out. So there are various authors which may have various approaches. Some may make simple things complex. Most of the times it's yes. And some may make your uh, complex stuff very simple. So choosing right mentorship, right guidance is again most important. And uh, according to me, this is the biggest one. People have absolutely no idea what to be followed. Absolutely no idea. Trust me. So if you want to work out with screwdriver, you need to choose right instrument. If you try to work it out with, uh, say, this instrument, whereas uh, you are not using the right screwdriver for handling the screw, then it's a big mess. So it's very crucial that you choose right question banks, which are quite aligned with the exams that will help you. And uh, no progress, no progress tracker. It's like, I would say spelling mistake. I would, so it's progress tracker. That's important. So if you, for any journey, it's very important to know where you have rest and how much it has to be covered. So progress tracker is most important, very crucial, not in just a farm journey, but if you are like, you want to evaluate where you are, you need to quantify yourself on certain parameters. So same applies to a farm journey as well. And no structured way, of course, uh, like if I were to name, give an example, order of subjects in which order you should study what are the most important topics from the exam point of view. So it is also important along with the progress tracker. So get yourself organized, have a progress tracker along with you, have a right mentorship, have a right question bank. If you think we can, we can cater you best on these parameters, please do reach out to our team. They will be happy to assist you. And this is something uh, I would say if you are not dedicated, then God bless you. No one can help you out. See, FRM is most valuable in entire world. It's globally valuable. So it needs high level of commitment. Of course, you have got right mentor, you got organized, you have got right question banks. But if you are not dedicated, then no one can help you out. This is again most important. Work hard. Even if you are working full time, take out some time. Have a daily reading stuff. Practice daily reading stuff that can get you through. Right mentorship along with your dedication. That that that's the key. So, yeah, I mean, as I said, if you think we can get you best in all parameters, then please do get in touch with our team. They'll be happy to assist you in all terms. And yes, please do subscribe to our channel. We keep coming with a lot of videos like this and uh, it may help you a lot and uh, it will make you uh, up to date in all context. And uh, and yeah, I mean, if you look at our tagline, it says we can make you think. That's the most important thing when it comes to practical exams like this. And yes, please do subscribe, like and share with your peers. And stay connected with the channel. Thank you very much for staying connected till the end of the video. Thank you.